Hello, my Devo Tribers. I missed you, but I'm back. And we are on the last day of July. Like summer is just moving by so quickly. July 31st. And for those of you probably just joining in, this is Heroes in Training, where together we are learning to be heroes for our Heavenly Father through learning about tips from this great book. Today's July 31st with the scripture text taken from Deuteronomy 4, verses 30 and 31, which says, when you are in distress, when you turn to the Lord your God and obey his voice, he will not forsake you. An obedient hero. Pick up the dog. Caitlin only had time to scoop her Jack Russell Terrier penny into her arms before a solid white blur knocked them to the ground. Caitlin had spent a fun afternoon with her Pathfinder group hiking at Sweetwater Creek. They were tired after a long day and a nature scavenger hunt. They were sitting on a fence to rest when Caitlin heard her pastor yell to pick up Penny. Without question, she yanked Penny's leash and grabbed her in her arms just as a white pit bull charged them and knocked them off the fence. The big dog had broken free from its leash and was after Penny. Caitlin hadn't seen the other dog coming, but thankfully her pastor had. The angry dog stood over Caitlin trying to get to Penny who had been knocked out of Caitlin's arm in the fall and had just enough room to reach to get out of reach of the pit bull's snapping jaws. Quickly, an adult ran to help, pulling the angry dog off Caitlin. Everyone was so thankful that Caitlin's angel had protected them and that both she and Penny were okay. Caitlin knew that even though most dogs are friendly, she should never approach a strange dog, strange dog until she knew for sure. She also knew that she shouldn't run and scream if she was chased. Because she stayed still and covered her head and face with her arms when she was knocked down, the dog didn't hurt her. And because she obeyed quickly, Penny was saved too. Obeying your parents and God is important. They don't just give you orders to make life hard. They want the best for you and are trying to protect you. Be like Caitlin today and be a hero for God. Let's pray. Father, sometimes it's really hard to be obedient, especially if it is something that we want to do on our own. But may we be obedient because as heroes, heroes listen to you, oh God. I know I struggle with this in some areas of my life a lot. I pray to just help as you're helping me to help other superheroes in training, that we will be obedient, that we will be true, that we will trust your words. Father, help us today. Thank you for your love today. In Jesus' name, amen. My heroes in training, let's together be an obedient hero for God. I'll see you tomorrow.